Republican presidential candidate Mitt Romney getting ready to launch a direct response to all the criticism over his career at the private equity firm Bain Capital. Chief Washington correspondent Peter Cook has more on his counterattack. Peter. Well, that's right, Betty. Voters in South Carolina, Florida, and beyond about to hear a lot more about Bain Capital than they probably ever wanted to know in the first place, both pro and con. Now, the Romney campaign is getting set to launch a much more aggressive response to all that criticism of Romney's private equity career. It will include some ads, testimonials from workers at companies that benefited from Bain Investments, a direct rebuttal here to that 30-minute anti-Romney web video released by a super PAC supporting Newt Gingrich. Romney on Wednesday acknowledged... He he didn't see the Republican criticism coming. We've understood from a long time that, uh, that the Obama people would come after a free enterprise. Uh, a little surprised to see Newt Gingrich as the first witness for the prosecution. Romney says he doesn't think the Bain story will damage his campaign for president, but the new ad rollout Betty shows they are worried about it. And Peter, I know you've been truth squatting that anti-Romney documentary. What have you been? What have you found so far? Well, first of all, it is very tough, very critical of Romney and Bain Capital. It focuses on four Bain companies using interviews with people identified as former employees, and it also includes some news accounts. Here's one worker talking about Romney. I feel that is the man that destroyed us. Strong stuff, but the documentary also takes some liberties with the facts. Here's one example. By 2009, the debt accumulated under Romney was too great. KB Toys was no more. <laughs> Make a profit. That's the name of the game, right? Now, Bain is accused in the film of saddling KB Toys under so much debt that it had to close. But in fact, the company blamed the same weak retail market that brought down chains such as Linens and Things and Circuit City. The question, could voters who watch the video still blame Romney for that? Maybe. And Betty, again, that's why his campaign now wants to share Bain's success stories as well. Okay, Peter, thank you so much.